Double trouble. Good morning. Good breakfast, always important. Welcome in sunny Portugal, where we will host the first race of the TCR European Championship at this cool track, Portimao. The plans for 2022 is, uh, is doing as uh, much as touring car racing as uh, possible. Uh, we will do the TCR European Championship, which is uh, a championship with uh, this car. And of course, I will do the WTCR, which is the World Championship. So uh, yeah, both championships, I think, uh, very competitive, very nice to drive. Two different type of styles, because uh, you can feel, you know, the European Championship is maybe a little bit more relaxed, a little bit more yeah, let's say customer racing style and the World Championship is a little bit more uh, political, clever, big push, you know, uh, everything very much on the limit. Uh, yeah, this is, uh, this is the feeling I have, but uh, you know, Tommy style is race as much in touring cars as possible. Uh, watch it, eh? a lot of people. Can Yep, first session of TCI Europe is going to begin. My office for today, Portimao of course. from a beautiful Portimao circuit for the opening round of the 2022 TCR Europe. Already underway for the opening qualifying session, Q1 for our two races that take place, one today and one tomorrow afternoon. Fan favorite Tom Coronel returns to TCR Europe. Once again, you cannot miss the very distinctive come to you racing Audi. Q1, the only important top 10, Josh Files, our provisional pole sitter from Klim Gavrilov in second place. Isidro Callejas in fifth position, just ahead of Turing Car veteran and fan favourite Tom Coronel in P6. Okay, welcome everybody here in Portimao. Oh, the legend. Uh, no, you're the legend. You're, I'm, uh, you still fit in there? <laughs> so what did I order? The underwear. Yes. Coke Brown. TTM. I just uh, did a small takeover. Yeah. Sepp is getting ready. It's getting hot, boss. Yeah. That's a mega. Well done. Thank you, thank you, mate. Well done. When you go to the grid, just got a taxi ride from Mr. Riba. It's uh, 100 euros, my friend. No problem, put it on the bill. <laughs> The TCR European season starts here. Ah, there we go. First race of the season in the Audi. I think uh, we did very well. P7, everything was really, really close. It will be a big battle. It's very hot. I can feel already in the warm up lap that the tires are having some difficulties. But uh, let's wait to see. I think uh, be clever in the first two, uh, two, three laps and attack in the end. The red lights are on. They go out and we are go for 2022. Coming down in the first corner, three wide, Tom Coronel in the middle of them. All fighting for that last bit of tarmac. So here we go, the checker flag waves for the very first time. Jack Young is our first winner. I had a good start, but I was just uh, stuck. So, and then we touched a little bit. Finally, nobody went out and uh, nobody had a mechanical uh, failure, but P8, good start of the season.
Race two of the season, starting from P4. Yesterday we noticed that it should happen in the first two laps, so let's attack there and then uh, try to see if I can bring a trophy home. We are going for the second race of the first round of TCI Europe. Tom Coronel wants to get a little nudge to the rear of the Hyundai, tries to make his way past. Tom Coronel takes away fourth position. That's a fantastic overtaking manoeuvre. Side by side again, Ariola and Girolami off the racetrack. Contact between the two of them. Franco Girolami has the deal done. Tom Coronel, ever the wily fox. Tom Coronel waiting for an opportunity. There it comes. I'll walk through that door and show you how it's done. Ladies and gentlemen, that's how you pass in a touring car. Bam, bam. Thank you, man. Franco Girolami crosses the line, takes the checkered flag and wins the second race of the opening round. Tom Coronel just about hangs on to third position. Yeah, that was a good one. Finally, I could catch uh, Felipe under the braking. I could see whether he was having some difficulties. But in the end, I was losing some pace. That's a good feeling. But finally, P3, happy to start the season like this. Thank you!